All right, boys, Need for Speed Unbound. Uh, they just dropped a freaking, uh, well, I guess not just, it was an hour ago. I'm a little late. But um, some news. Look at that about post launch content and stuff. So uh, I'm going to read it to you real quick. It's the holiday season, blah, blah, blah. So check out what's in store for Need for Speed next year in 2023. Hint the first update will focus on social play. Hopefully, we get some fixes. Anyway, look. Um, it's a full thread, but I think there's more information here. Weird. Um, it's been white knuckles since our global release, blah, blah, blah. You've been along for the ride since the beginning. So we wanted to take a moment to thank you for being on this journey with us, but don't think that we're done yet. Not by a long shot. That's good news. Um, teams are going to take a quick holiday break. Um, basically here's what's coming an upcoming series of post launch content updates and experience packs. I don't know what an experience pack is. Maybe like how we're at kind of, I think we're capped at level 99. So like now we'll go from level 100 to 200 maybe on the next update. And then there'll be like, we can get like underglow or under other stuff. Maybe, maybe that's what an experience pack is, um, as well as free access to new modes, social features and progression for Lakeshore online. Um, look, if they keep adding that every couple months, I'm, I'm fine with that, man. And the new modes, if you remember, they talked about like pink slips and stuff like that. Um, hopefully drifting will come nighttime cops. Um, yeah, the first update will focus on expanding social play features. So that's what our, our first update is going to be. It did say uh, towards the end of January. Um, more info and updates from us towards the end of January. So hopefully we get an update and then more info about the next one. But um, social play features, I don't know if that just means maybe they're going to switch up how we can do races instead of just people in, in the, the server or lobby you're in. Maybe it's like a, a better matchmaking system. Um, but social play features, I don't quite know what that could mean. Um, but anyway, besides that, it says, and future updates will bring new modes and features, cars, customization content, and more. Cars. I'm, I'm happy about that. We get new cars. We get new customization. If you guys have seen, like, we've, I think people have been digging up some stuff. Um, like they dug up like Eddie's kit for the Skyline, Rachel's 350Z, um, or something else. And there's like a Porsche kit that we've been seeing in one of the race thumbnails with like a turbo with a rear bumper removal that nobody's been able to find. So maybe like that, that'll be in there. Um, stay tuned for more details, blah, blah, blah. Stay safe, happy, have a hop holidays, and we'll see you in 2023. But um, yeah, I mean, I think it's cool that they at least touch on that because it's been a little dry. Um, so another month and a half and we'll get some content, which uh pretty happy about. I mean, if they if they keep doing gradual updates like this and adding cars and new stuff, that we definitely need more underglow, um, new customization modes maybe we'll get takeovers online maybe we'll get like speed lists and we can actually like have you know if we place if we if we track you know a time we hit whatever like a minute 58 on the track it'll it'll keep track and it'll show like an auto log or like what what your friends have done or other people like you know but then there's gonna be you know the cheaters that freaking hack the game or run in there with the pista and you're never gonna get first i don't know We'll see what happens, but uh, we definitely need a way to be competitive with other people to like fight for times and do time attacks because that, that's definitely lacking from online. But anyway, I just wanted to drop this information for you guys. You guys know the drill subscribe. Come back. Check out our engine builds. We got a ton for like S plus tier, B tier. I haven't really done any other tiers yet. We've done a couple AA plus S. Anyway, boys, see you on the next one.